goals define the point at which a pre-identified problem is no longer a concern. That is, they define success for a team's problem-solving efforts, at which point teams are satisfied with the observed frequency, intensity, or duration of a behavior. By definition, a problem exists when there is a difference between what is observed and what is expected. Efforts at defining this threshold or goal for problem resolution must explicitly state the measurable change that must be seen for the problem to no longer be considered a problem or when teams say the problem no longer exists. Goals must detail the change that is desired and the timeline for this change or the what and when. When teams focus on the what aspect of a goal, they are defining the target or comparison, such as some criterion, benchmark, or expectation. For example, being at or below the national median for office discipline referrals. Goals also must indicate the change desired, an increase or decrease in the frequency or intensity of the behavior, or a movement from one status level to another. Finally, goals should include the timeline for when their target must be met. This when component also sets the pace at which the change must occur. Goals defined with these critical components highlight not only the finish line, but also the intensity of the solutions needed to move the observed behavior toward the goal. In short, this clarity not only helps identify the parameters of success, but also assists teams in picking solutions that promote positive outcomes.